So, you're probably thinking, oh my gosh, how can I do this in my Minecraft world? I could show you, but first, we need to start at the beginning. Today, we're taking a look at my mod, The History Update. So, before we take a look at Herobrine, we need to take a look at the in-game storyline that comes with this mod. This starts with an ancient book called The Beginning. This peculiar looking book explains how the in-game Minecraft universe began. But as you read more into this book, you'll find that there's an odd dimension revealed. This dimension is dubbed the Lear. We'll talk more about this dimension later. This book also references another book that shows you how to get to the Lear. If you get your lucky hands on this book, you'll find that there's an odd block in the portal frame that is shown in this book. This block is called Bluestone, and the only way to obtain it in the overworld is a rare biome called the Lie Biome. Fun fact, the name Lie is one R short of the name Lear. And that's because the lie and leer biomes are identical, with one exception. The lie biome is missing hero brine, but more on that later. Anyway, after you build that frame, you can light it and head into the leer dimension. But wait, I'm sure you probably have a couple of questions. First, why would one go to the Lear? Well, that's because the Lear dimension is where Herobrine himself resides. One more thing before you face Herobrine. Herobrine is very deadly, so we need to learn all about him. Herobrine, to put it simply, is a very powerful creature. Not only does he have a lot of health, but he's also insanely quick. And not only that, but he also has a secret weapon, and that's the ghoul. The ghoul is a lot like a zombie, and while the ghoul may seem weak with his low health and attack, it will attack any creature that crosses its path, whether that be animal or player. And if it does kill something, another ghoul will spawn. Not only that, but every time Herobrine is hit, he will spawn a ghoul. Getting scared yet? That's alright, because we added some special tools to the game to aid you in the fight. To get them, all you will need to do is to go to a special dimension called the Underworld, and grab some of the new ores that we added. But you'll also need food to nourish you during the fight, and that's why we've added a special type of food. They're called Snowberries. These berries are extremely common, and while they aren't useful by themselves, they can be used to craft some various different foods that will give you awesome buffs. Now you're ready to go face Herobrine and earn the totem of Herobrine, which is perfect to show off to your friends. 